Annotations are really fun, and in a lot of cases, they're easier and quicker than using a PowerPoint animation to call attention to you know, some text or some other objects on your slide. With this approach, you just come up here to your Articulate menu and then click Add Annotations. And that's going to open up this window here where you can insert annotations to appear in time with the audio that you've already added to your slide. There are quite a few styles here you can choose from. Lots of different arrows. There's check marks, this cross shape, a rectangle, a spotlight. And also, once you choose one of these tools, you'll have some options in this style area to customize the way it looks. Like if you want it to be animated or in the case of a spotlight, you can choose you know, the style of corners things like that. So you'll want to definitely explore your options there. So when you're ready, you just hit this gray button here that says Start Annotation, and that'll start your slide playing in this preview area down here. So you'll see the slide play out with whatever you know animations you've already applied. You'll hear your audio play. And at the point that you want your annotation to appear, you just use your mouse cursor here to insert it onto your slide. And it's as simple as that. So let's just say we want to add a spotlight annotation to this slide. We want to add the spotlight to appear on top of this word paragraph at the end of the slide. So I've already selected my spotlight tool and I've set some preferences here already for things like the style, you know, like I'm going to have this animated effect, I'm going to use rounded corners, things like that. And now I'm ready to go ahead and annotate. So I'm going to hit the start annotation button. We're going to hear my audio start playing a little bit in the background. And at the point when I want my spotlight to come on screen, I'm just going to draw it right on top of that word. So we'll go ahead and do that. I want to draw attention to a specific word in this paragraph. And that's the end of my slide. And I could hit the stop button or I could just wait for the slide to finish playing out. And now I can go ahead and replay this by hitting the play button here on the control panel and make sure it looks the way that I want and the timing looks good. But for now, let's just go ahead and save and close out of here and we'll do a preview of the slide itself so you can see what it would look like you know, with the player and everything. So when we preview this slide, we'll see that spotlight come on screen in the preview. So there's my audio and there's my spotlight that comes on screen. So it's really quite simple and it's kind of fun to play with the different options that are available. Now if you want to learn a little bit more about annotations, um, we do have some tutorials that go into more depth. And if you want to take a look at those, they're really helpful and they can help you walk through a lot of your other options for customizing things. So you want to click on the Tutorials tab in eLearning Heroes and then go to the Articulate Products section and in the presenter section of the tutorials, you'll see this option here called annotations, and that'll take you to a couple tutorials that you can take a look at.